All right, we're going to show you how to skin out a paw. There's a couple of different ways you can do it. Um, a lot of people, a lot of guides will split right through the pad, and I don't recommend that unless you're not going to use the pads. Or if you're going to do a rug, that's fine. But if you want to do a life-size mount and you want to expose the pad, you can do it a couple ways. You can stop right here at the pad, which is what I'm going to do. I'll show you how to do that. And then I'm just going to skin it out and turn it inside out. Um, but if you can't do it that way, some people don't have the hand strength to do it because these are really tough. You can cut up to here and then just very carefully cut around the pad. And I like to leave a little bit of skin with the hair on it so that when you sew this up, you can hide your seam. There's no seam visible. So you can do it, you can go both ways or you can just come up here and cut around one side, up around the toes here and lift this pad off and expose the bones. Um, that just makes a little more sewing and I, I don't really like to sew that much so we're going to show you how, to, how I do it. I'm going to finish this cut. I'm going to cut right to the pad and stop here. Okay. Now we need to, I'm going to drill a hole through a bone here so that I can put a wire, I'll hang it, hang it from a nail in the ceiling and that will give us a, a secure anchor spot. Alright, now use a scalpel. Uh, some people like to use these uh, knives, they're called a bird's beak knife. Uh, I use it a lot for, for caping. Uh, but for these, I generally I just use a scalpel. All right, now we're just going to work our way around. Just take your time. Cut this foot loose. I'm going to spin this around here a little bit. Just keep tension on that. where your toe is at. We're getting close to the, the small toe over here, so be careful. down in behind the pad there to loosen this up a little bit. This is where you got to be careful. It'll let out eventually. Let's keep working right down here. Now we're going to skin it down to the last joint there. Cut it loose. Be careful. Need a lot of pliers. Here. Just slowly work your way down. 